Country Club reunion, 18th of April 2015. And with the DJ Dave Scott. So, hello Dave Scott, how are you doing? How are you doing, Dion? Not bad, not are bad. Are you going to tell me about your set tonight? I do. Uh, I'm playing last set, as usual. <laughs> I love doing the last set. I am going to be smashing it out. Expect it hard and fast. Yeah. Those are the old German classics. You always used to do the last set in the Country Club. It was an awesome atmosphere. Absolutely loved it. So, what was your favourite memory from the country club? Can you give us a favourite memory? Was there too many? Oh, uh, some of some of the favourite memories they like, really were the Valentine's night. Um, you know, the special nights and that. It was always absolutely rocking in that place. Absolutely sure, even New Year's Eve. Uh, just absolutely heaving, some of the best atmospheres I've ever experienced in my life, like, really. Without a doubt, it's yeah. absolutely rammed at those, wasn't it? Yeah. It's like rammed tonight else, as well. Rammed yeah, tonight. It's absolutely rammed tonight. The Punch Club reunion, three years on, it's absolutely amazing. So, I yeah. think that it's just going to go off as always. It is, it? it's going to go on and on and on, like, why shouldn't it? Why shouldn't it? It was a, it was well, a we special could, place. Yeah, and, and we keep it for Clive's memory, definitely. Yeah. Clive was the one that invented it. We're going to come here and live it every year, I think. So we we'll look forward to your set. Indeed. I look forward to playing it. Like, I look forward to seeing everyone stomping. Let's everyone fucking have it. Stomping. <laughs> yeah, amazing. set ready to start with a bit of um, a bit of trance maybe move into a bit of hard house but some old some new um, and a few classics as well sort of remixed in there so yeah just um, looking forward to it only downside playing the same time as lab four but hey ho I don't get to see them but to hopefully, be honest, hopefully people are running like around I guess just obviously pertinent to mention, you know, the, the, the bloke who brought all this together and, and, and well remembered Clive, you know, from, from, from everyone here, really. And I guess we're all going to raise a dance and a bit of a smile to, to the legend that is, you know, Clive. Today has been a massive sellout. It's Punch Club Union 2015. This is the third year in a row, raising money for Macmillan Council. Absolutely amazing atmosphere. Here we go. Amazing. This guy has been keeping the vibe alive for years at the Punch Club, back along. And 
Safe House Radio, tell me all about that. Yeah, well, we, um, we started Safe House Radio uh, about 18 months ago, um, and because of my connection with the country club from late 90s kind of onwards, um, we decided to do uh, 12 shows leading up to this event, so from 12 weeks ago. Um, and we did uh, guest mixes from all the resident DJs um, and all the uh, guest DJs as well. We had um, Lab 4, um, we had the organ donors as well doing a guest mix for us, as well as all the residents, and it's been absolutely fantastic. Um, so many people have been listening and, and really getting involved with it as well, which is so important um, and, and as a result of that I think we've got the message out a little bit further and even maybe to an audience that perhaps wouldn't have understood about the country club and, and really didn't know what the country club was and you can see from the atmosphere downstairs tonight and some of the age group that's down there that it's really had a massive effect there's people in that crowd tonight that have never been to the country club exactly got all the newbies and that's what it's about that's what it's all about getting them all into the trance bringing them up the way they were years ago You're taking this, this this brand that he had and, and taking it to new and better things and, and that's what's important for me, you know, we can everyone can play old school trance anthems and, and, and music that was tried and tested and tested by us, the DJs that played it back in the late 90s when it was, you know, is this tune going to work? Is that tune going to work? Um, and now we're just plucking out the ones that we know work and, and that's really relatively easy to do. The trick now is to take that crowd and take them onto a new level where we're taking risks again and playing brand new music and that's what Clive would have wanted and you know that's what Clive would have wanted. Thank you so much Mark. Absolute Lovely pleasure. Talking to you. All right. and we're here with the last three years Country Club winners. We've got Terry, Jake and Dan. How was your set this evening? Uh, it was good. It was definitely nerve wracking at first. But the crowd seemed to enjoy it for, for a first set. Yeah, I couldn't really ask for, for much more time on this set. So what gave you the inspiration for the tunes and everything you played tonight? The Country Club, I was never actually sort of, oh, well, I wasn't old enough to go to the Country Club in the first place, but obviously I've, I've heard sets by, by friends, sort of Jake Cairns and things like that, and I uh, sort of got my inspiration from there. I, my, my mum was sort of into the, the, the early trance music, and I was sort of brought up with that sort of music, so I had sort of an idea of, of what it's all about. And yeah, obviously hearing, hearing sets from the Country Club, I sort of managed to blend them two together, and yeah, I come up with my set. Well, I must admit, your set absolutely blew everyone away tonight. You must be very proud. How are you, awesome? Yeah, I was. It went off really well. Like I said, the crowd, the crowd was, was, was loving it. And um, yeah, it was good. good, good, good absolutely fantastic. fantastic. Lovely to speak to you, Dan. Thank you very much. See ya.
buzzing. It's yeah. just like we're going to go back in the day and make it. Oh yeah, man, yeah. the vibe's good. It's going to be a full bench tonight. We should have 800 in. Um, we kept it all on one level this year. I think it's going to be a really good atmosphere. Um, yeah, country comes alive again, like, you know. Oh, that's amazing. Can I ask you one thing before we go? What was your best memory of the country club, if you can remember? Oh my god, the Too best, it's just it's <laughs> ridiculous like, do you know what I mean, it was just, every week for me was amazing, do you know what I mean, it was just um, a second home for me, I love the place, I love the people, I, all my friends went to the country club, and um, yeah, there's no one night that was like stands out for me or anything, but it was just a special place, and they'll just like, you know, they'll never, never be, like it in the world, I don't so think yeah. so anyway, like, you know, it's, um, it had a unique vibe for what it was. And, and I've been to many clubs and nothing's come close to the like that. Oh, not that. There's many a good club out there, but just the country club has something very special. Salute. 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 Salute.